<laughs> this one was probably written as tune. I don't know, 87 maybe. And it's I've cut it a couple of times. One time it ended up on a record called Live at Tibetina's. Hey! 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 98. Got it. But here's the uh, back in the 80 sometime. to say about it. The record was called Osborne Orchestra. Yeah. It was a bad name because orchestra means there's an eight-piece band, which there wasn't. So I changed it in second pressing to Doing Fine. And then I leased out, or I licensed the master to it, to a, a label I was on for a minute called Shanaki. They released it 2004 as a brand new release. And I'm like, dude. <laughs> like I re record for 15 plus years and then all of a sudden I sound like that. <laughs> but on this first record I was working with some cats from Europe. I was working George Porter. Uh, Peter, another friend of mine, Pete, Pete, oh, what's his name? <laughs> we were not really good friends, but he was a great guy. He moved to Houston. He was a nervous wreck, though, this guy. <laughs> what, what, what kind of groove do you want? What kind of groove do you want? Seriously, Andrew, what kind of groove do you want? <laughs> and George was looking at his watch. Like, yep. So are we, are we doing this? <laughs> we recorded at Ultrasonic Studios on Washington Avenue in Mid-City, New Orleans. Hey, hey. Yeah. There's a Summer rain. 